What's up, Stack Collect? This is your boy H Stats, and man, oh man, my most anticipated piece of the year collaboration with uh, XM Studios Legendary Beasts uh, Studios Hulk has finally arrived. And as you can see, it came in these big ass shipping boxes. UPS had them labeled for 70 pounds each, but I'm the Hulk. I can easily lift that kind of weight. Those of you who are new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and notification bell. This way you guys are going to know all about my up and coming content. So let's get to the unboxing because I'm really excited to see what this bad boy looks like in person. One. All right, guys. So here's the art box. This is what it really looks like. There's two big ass boxes and this is the first one. I just want you guys to see uh, the first uh, art box with the uh, the base. So let's go to the styrofoam. Okay, so here's the styrofoam. Um, this is actually um, the heaviest out of the biggest box. I mean, this thing is heavy and I didn't expect the base to be this uh, size. So let's uh, take the straps off and let's see what the uh, base looks like. Okay, so the straps are off. Let's open up this bad boy and let's see what awaits us. Holy crap. Holy crap. And then, of course, it's that chemical smell, again, that keeps us highly addicted to this hobby. Just going to have to clean all that uh, foam up later. But, damn, I mean, look at the size of this thing. Holy crap. Um, let me see if I can measure it real quick to see how big it is. Pause. Um, before I take it out of the... Uh, the styrofoam box and the width of this base holy crap it's probably over it's about 23 and a half inches wide holy crap so I definitely got to start uh, getting rid of some stuff um, but you know what luckily enough I had to uh, sell my sideshow uh, Hulk to get this bad boy so shout out to that buyer that didn't you know try to pay for my uh, sideshow hulk for five bucks all right so i'm not going to take it out the box <laughs> i'm not going to take it out the box on camera uh all right, right so back. i managed to pull it out and it's very thin because um as you know you could use this piece if you just want like uh the statue to be a little bit lower but man this is this is crazy i mean it's really wide all right so let's look at the uh put this on the table back here and let's look at the second piece and this is the piece that I think that is you know the masterpiece that has all the um, iconic uh, characters on a, around the base all right so I pull that out so you guys can't see me sweat um check this out I mean this is iconic it's like a bronze golden kind of look it's really heavy. I say this thing is about maybe about <clears throat> let's say about 25 pounds max. All right, let's get this on the table. I'll give you guys close-ups later. Okay, here's the uh, other styrofoam. Uh, this one is actually bigger than the other uh, uh, styrofoam box. Let's open it up. All right, so the uh, straps are off. Let's see what awaits us. A holy mother holy mother i mean now this is a hulk absolutely massive i mean it is huge holy crap man and let's see if i can just turn it around uh there's some like waxy wet look on it but i i, I don't know i guess that's an effect but um uh-oh Looked like some damage here. Yeah, as you guys can see, the paint. See, this is why we got to be careful. If you see that stain right there, it looks like the paint came off on the statue. So that's a no-no. <laughs> that's a no-no. Yeah. That's not a good. That's not a good look. Wow. All right, but we will call up the authorities. <laughs> And find out so I mean just look at this absolutely amazing um, the only flaw I'm still thinking let me know guys um, 
if I could just send this piece back because um I mean check this out I don't know they waited until this thing actually dried but you can see here you know the paint kind of like came off on this thing and I don't know if I could let that go um leave me some comments let me know if I should contact <laughs> you know uh the seller and address this because as you can see here you see that paint where it looks like it's kind of like faded that's definitely not a good look i mean great piece but i don't know if i can let that slide all right so as you can see it's like this hulk probably must weigh like about at least five and a half maybe ten pounds uh it's really heavy let's see what the uh the bottom half looks like all right so here's the um the half the legs of the body um let's see okay uh, i don't want to pull it out this is not going to break easily so don't have to worry about that i mean i just stand him up i mean just look at the size of this thing i mean i'm struggling to hold it it is really i mean look at the feet damn i gotta put it down because it's really really heavy and um i forgot to mention it kind of comes it comes with a booklet oops tilted the camera um it comes with a booklet and in the booklet it's just some um art print gives you a little explanation that he's the strongest Avenger and this shouldn't be a hard assembly it's literally like four pieces to put together and here's some other stuff here you know um, the Martin range face Hulk is the one that I decided to go with and then of course you got the Hulk um, evolution on the base the origin story transformation incredible en enemies and um, and this is just a little dialogue here for the uh, collector. So, really, really awesome. All right, so let's put them together. All right, guys, so this thing is really heavy. Uh, I guess we got to start with just placing, like, lining this up. So, um, we're just going to, I guess, put this here on top. There we go. As you see, that's easy. And then let's get this heavy ass <laughs> feet. And as you can see, the plank, and I'm just tipping the camera, but this thing is heavy. <laughs> and then that kind of like just goes here. And it kind of slides in easily. Okay, so the, um, the upper part is really not that heavy and you can just slide it in easily like so and there you have it. I mean <laughs> unbelievable. I mean this is definitely 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 I don't know this thing should have been like a life-size statue because it is freaking huge. Uh, to give you guys an idea of how tall this thing is from the base let's say all the way uh, to the the head um this is almost as big as uh let's say my bane so it's about 30 38 and a, 38 and a half inches high and i mean it's just an incredible piece i absolutely love it i can't even fit it on the turntable so i'm just gonna have to give you guys a quick close-up by just uh panning around with my uh my camera all right so you can see here here's the uh hulk evolution and I like the different phases of the uh, the Hulk evolution. Really, really cool. And the bottom of this base, like I said, it has like, a, you know, this uh, bronze, golden kind of look. Um, I, I really got to find some place to put this bad boy because uh, this is like a baby life-size statue. So let's go on this side where you have here um, how he became 
the uh, Hulk from this radiation, which is a good thing. And then the back of it here um, is the enemies of the Hulk. Um, General Ross, you know, Red uh, Hulk, which I have Abomination, uh, the leader, Juggernaut. Uh, th these are the two I don't remember off the top of my head, but I will find out. <laughs> and then um, the other side here is uh, the Transformation Hulk. So if you missed out on the XM Studio Hulk Transformation, at least you got something here that's engraved that will remind you of. Now let's just look at the size of this foot. My goodness, I mean, this foot is huge. I mean, if I put my hand here, just look, that's the size <laughs> of this foot. This this statue is huge. Um, look at the, uh, the base. I mean, absolutely crazy, you know, really, really crazy. And let's go to that famous mug shot. Holy crap. I mean, that is the, I mean, the teeth, the paint job on the teeth got some glare, looks like some saliva, looks kind of wet, tongue red. I mean, his eyes, the pupils are so like heavily dilated that he just looks insane. Like I wouldn't want to have anything to do with this Hulk. And then, you know, the others, you know, some hands are open. I like the clinch fist. I mean, look at the size. I mean, my hand is a little bit bigger, but it's almost the size of my hand. You know, I mean, he's just ready to go to war. I mean, ready to just knock someone out completely. I mean, it's just absolutely insane. Phenomenal job. That paint job, you see here? This is what I mean. Like, it looks kind of like wet because I guess the, the factory didn't give it time to dry. So you kind of have like a little, you know, you see, glistening kind of look. I don't know if I should just leave it or be anal about it, you know. But guys, leave me again, leave me a comment. Let me know what I should do if I should just call and complain about it. All right, guys. So, you know, basically, I wish I could give you guys a, you know, uh, a spin on the turntables. But this thing is just too massive uh, for it to fit on the uh, turntable. But I want to give you also the width from, I guess, one arm to the next. And that's about 20 five inches so you really got to have some room <laughs> for this thing i have a spot for it um just have to probably do some rearrangements around my place but i mean this is an iconic piece this is the best uh, uh hulk statue i have ever seen love it probably never gonna get rid of it and um i mean if you guys agree with me if you like my video make sure you hit that like button and those of you who are new to my channel make sure you hit that subscribe button and notification bell this way you're going to know all about my up and coming content and man you really really got to know what you're doing when you pick this bad boy up because i mean this is the hulk and i don't know if i'm going to get <laughs> any more legendary beast statues because i mean these things take up a, a tremendous amount of space and my wife is going to kill me but hey <laughs> you know this is what we do we love the hobby so guys, um, I hope you enjoyed my video. Again, those of you who are new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and notification bell. This way you're going to know all about my up and coming contact. And please leave me a like. It helps the uh, algorithm. And what I probably did in like four or five hours, I probably gave you like at least a 20, 15 minute video to enjoy. So that said, guys, keep your stats up and I'll definitely check you guys on the next one. One. Thanks for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed the video, but don't go anywhere. Make sure you check out my other videos to the playlist to the right. Have a good day. Peace.